So today we are talking about Martha Stewart. She's in Sports Illustrated in a swimsuit and looking amazing at 81. And since that time, we've had a few phone calls asking about what Martha's done. She denies plastic surgery. So it's hard to know how much of these photos are retouched and how much is truly her. All photos are retouched. And so, you know, some of the smoothness of the skin may be a result of a filter or retouching, but she is looking pretty amazing. And I'm, I've just been talking with patients about some non-surgical ways to achieve some of the results she seems to be getting. So, you know, when I look at her photo, I really notice from her prior photos, a huge change in the contour of her jawline and even the neck area it looks a lot tighter, a lot smoother. And so, there's a few things we can do to help that. I mean, I think the foundation, um, of course, is the quality of the skin, but also using Botox strategically in the jawline to help take away the downward pull of the neck and really crisp up the jawline. We call it the Nefertiti lift. We do it with Botox in the muscles of the neck and a little bit along the jawline itself. And that just really helps take away any downward drag on the face. I do think to get a crisper jawline, in my hands, filler works really well. A strong filler, a contouring filler, to really recreate a nice crisp line to the jaw, a little chin projection, and then balance that with a little lift in the cheeks. And that's what I see when I look at her face. I think easily those things can be achievable with fillers. Um, I imagine she started, you know, probably years in advance in things like Sculptra, or hyperdilute radius that stimulate collagen. They're injectables that stimulate collagen is a really great way to go. They can be done in the chest, the neck, uh, the lower face, the temples, really throughout um, most of the body, honestly. And that's gonna help the body intrinsically make more collagen. And that's what we wanna do. As we're aging, collagen is declining and we need to continually do treatments to bump that back up whether it's topical Retin-A, injectable Sculptra, um, Morpheus microneedling, we really want to focus on collagen stimulation and clearly she's been working on that for some time. Her skin looks amazing. I'm sure she's done some skin treatments and she's not shy about saying the products that she uses for her skin as well. So all in all, I think great job, Martha, especially at 81. And there are a lot of ways non-surgically to really enhance your looks the way she has.